Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Girls Always Talk. I hope you guys are all doing fabulous. Yes, you heard me, fabulous. Today I'm going to be making a decorative Valentine's Day shower curtain. So I'm just going to jump right into it with the things that I'm going to be using. So I'm going to be needing a scissors, okay. Also, I'm going to be needing these heart gems. These I got at the dollar store, okay. Also need some ribbons and I got I got this in red because of course I'm trying to keep with the Valentine's theme. And you're also going to need a shower curtain liner. Hopefully you can see that. Okay. And this I got too at the dollar store as well. Also, you're going to be needing a share curtain panel. And this also comes from the dollar store. Okay. Uh, these hearts, again, from the dollar store. Okay, so you need a couple packages of those. Also, you're going to be needing some shower curtain rings, and I got these ones. Okay. And these beautiful hearts. Look at that. Okay, and these I got at the dollar store. Okay, these are the gem, the gems hearts in red. Okay. Also, you're going to be needing a glue gun. Okay, with some glue sticks. Alrighty. And that is it, guys. So if you guys want to see how I'm going to do this, keep watching. So, guys, I'm just going to unpackage this um, curtain panel. Okay. So, this is it. So, what I'm going to do is I am going to open it out. And I'm going to go ahead and, oops, I'm going to open it up just like this. And I'm going to, okay guys, so the first thing we're going to do here is we're going to chase or cut out um, our letters that we're going to be needing. And the letters are going to be love XOXO, okay? So you can make them out of paper. Or you can go ahead and make it out of fabric. Okay, either way, it's just as good. So we're going to try and come up with the words, the letters, L-O-V-E-X-O-X-O. -X -O. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this ribbon, okay? And I'm going to place the letters on top of the ribbon like that, okay? And then I'm going to grab my scissors. And then I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to cut out all the letters that I need. Okay? So you can stick a pin in there just to keep it in place, but I don't need to do that. So basically, I'm just going to go ahead and I'm just going to cut this. I'll show you. Okay, I'm just going to cut it off like that, place this in the middle, and just go ahead and just cut, cut it out, okay? So that's all you need to do, cut out your letters, okay? So I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to finish cutting out my letters, and I will be right back to show you guys how I'm going to place them, okay? So first, remember, you got to cut out whatever the letters are that you're going to be using, okay? And one of my words are going to be love XOXO, okay? I'll be right back. Okay, guys, so I am finished cutting out my letters, okay? And I have positioned them where I want them to be on my curtain okay 
So make sure that um, you have the same distance from each ends, okay? And the same distance between the letters as well. And you know what? You can probably place them any which way you want. Anyway, this is just the way that I am going to be doing it, okay? So now I'm finished. I'm trying to put them in. I'm putting them in order the way I want them to be. And then at the bottom here, I'm going to have X. X, O. X. Okay. Hopefully you guys can see what I'm doing. I don't have a lot of working room, but I'll pull this up a little bit more just so you can see. Alrighty, so that is it right there. So now that I have positioned them where I want them, I am just going to go ahead and I'm going to glue them down, okay? So you're going to be needing your glue gun. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to leave them in place, take my glue gun, just tip a little bit of glue, not too much, and then I'm going to... Hold it down for a little while, just like that, until it sticks. Okay? And I'm just going to go around and just put a bit of glue on all of them. Okay? All of them. Just to make sure they stay in place. Alrighty, and I'll be right back. Okay guys, so here I'm back and I'm all finished gluing on my gems to my letters. Okay, and this is what it looks like. X and O's, X and O's. And this is the love right there. Okay, hopefully you guys can see that. So that's what it looks like. Okay, so keep watching. Okay guys, this is the bottom half of my curtain and um, I'm going to be using these hearts here that I showed you guys previously to create a heart shape on the bottom of my curtain, okay? So I'm just going to start out by positioning them where I want them. Okay, so keep watching. I'll be back to show you guys when I'm finished designing my heart. So guys, I am finished positioning my little hearts where I want them. And I have made a big heart. Okay. And um, these are what I use. To do them okay and all you got to do now is just get your glue gun okay and leaving them in position just place a little bit of glue there Oops. and just hold it in place okay and just continue to do the same With all of them until you've gotten all of them all glued down. Just like that. Okay, and guys, if it's easier for you, you can also pin them. Okay, pin them in place and this way you can just go around and glue all of them. And it might be easier for you to do that than to do them the way I'm doing them. Okay? So now that I've gotten them all down in place, this is what it looks like. Okay? And that's the bottom half. And then 
this is the top half okay so, so far that's what it looks like okay so keep watching so now I'm gonna go ahead and decorate the shower curtain rings okay these are the ones I got at the dollar store using these gem um, hearts they're so pretty okay so keep watching Okay guys, so the last thing is this curtain was a little bit too long for my um, bathroom. So what I did was I folded over, okay, like this. I did one fold over and I got my glue gun and I basically, hopefully you guys can see, just put a bit of glue right inside the part that I fold over and then I just press it down just to make it dry okay and I just basically went right along the top of it add some glue and pressed it down hold it for a little while till it's dry and that's it and I continued that just along the top bit of glue here and pressed it right down just like that to let it dry and there you got it okay and also, because this is uh, meant to be for a rod, okay, this curtain, what I've done is I've gone ahead and um, took a marker and I don't know if you guys can see it, just basically uh, mark the space that I want, okay, so I can put the shower rings. In there okay so that's what I'm gonna do now so guys this is the little spot that I marked out for the shower curtain ring to go through so what I'm gonna do is just gonna take the scissors and I'm just gonna make a little snip right there Okay, so there's the hole okay so I'm just gonna continue cutting them out I'll be right back okay guys this is it all finished and this is what it looks like beautiful I'm really happy with the way it all turned out okay and I also added a bow Alrighty, because I thought it would just give it a nice little flair, you know, a little bit more attitude, a little bit more character, and yes, I also did the curtains a little bit different. On one side, I did the love, the X and O's a little bit higher, 
And on the other side, I dropped it a bit lower. You can see. Okay, and I also did the same thing with the hearts as well. Okay. And these are the rings as well. I'm really excited with those, how they turned out. I added two hearts, the gems. And yes, they are fabulous. Beautiful. That's what it looks like. Hopefully you guys can see that. Let's see if I can get a real close shot. There they are. I just think that it just adds to the look of the curtain. So yes, that's what it looks like, guys. I hope you guys like. And yes, if you guys do like my video, give it a thumbs up. And remember, if you're not talking, no one's listening. What did I say? If you're not talking, ain't nobody listening. I love you guys, and I'll see you real soon. Bye. There you got it.